Picture this, you're hiking through a massive canyon, and towering cliffs of layered rock all around you. Ever wondered how those layers got there? Or how the ground beneath your feet was once part of an ancient sea or riverbed? Today, we're diving into the secret life of sedimentary rocks, the hidden storytellers of Earth's past. And trust me, by the end of this video, you'll be spotting them everywhere. Sedimentary rocks make up about 75% of the Earth's surface. These rocks are formed by particles, or sediments, that have been broken down from pre-existing rocks. Unlike igneous rocks that form from molten magma, or metamorphic rocks that are changed by heat and pressure, sedimentary rocks are all about layering and compacting over time. So let's break down that process. Step one in forming sedimentary rocks starts with weathering and erosion. Weathering happens when rocks are broken down by natural forces like wind, water, or even temperature changes. Next, we have transportation and deposition. The eroded sediments are transported by agents like rivers, wind, or ice. As these agents lose energy, the sediments settle and get deposited, often in layers. Picture a river flowing down a mountain. It carries sediment, but as it slows down at a lake or the ocean, the sediment sinks to the bottom, creating a layer. Now onto the final step, compaction and cementation. Over time, more and more layers of sediment build up. The weight of the upper layers compresses the lower ones, squeezing out the water and air. This is called compaction. And then minerals like quartz or calcite act as a glue and cement the sediments together, forming a solid rock. There are three main types of sedimentary rocks, based on the type of sediments they're made out of. First, you have clastic rocks, like sandstone and shale. These are made from fragments of other rocks. And then you have chemical sedimentary rocks, like limestone. These are formed from dissolved minerals that precipitate out of the water. And finally, you have organic sedimentary rocks, like coal, which is made from the remains of plants or animals. Pretty cool, right? Sedimentary rocks are super important to geologists. They often contain fossils, which help us understand Earth's history and ancient life. They also hold natural resources like oil, natural gas, and coal, making them valuable to our modern world. So to recap, sedimentary rocks form through weathering, erosion, transportation, deposition, compaction, and cementation. There are three main types, clastic, chemical, and organic, and they help us understand both the Earth's past and its present resources. If you enjoyed this video and learned something new, don't forget to give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel, and drop a comment below on what geology topic you want us to cover next. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.